Okay, guys, uh, we have uh, another challenge here, another game of the challenge Old School Co-op, in which you have to play any commander you wish, but only P0, and win Mild Warfare against uh, Double Edged and Minesweeper. This time we have 2-2, soloing with Tychus, P0, of course. So, uh... Uh, he has, uh, Odin Mastery. Uh, I think that will help a lot. But of course has to be careful then a uh, lot more with uh, his... Uh, Outlaws, okay, he's building auto turret. This is kind of interesting. Okay, and he, and he took both gases. Okay, now we have medivac platform. Okay, see grenade is pretty bad for Tychus, but it's only three stalkers, so uh, uh, Tychus didn't die. Okay, now he'll continue doing this with uh, SCVs because they don't uh, deal a lot of damage, so they will probably not uh, kill themselves. Okay, uh, throwing grenade and then immediately, <laughs> immediately lifting, that's uh, kind of cute. Okay, let's slow this down a bit, let's see what's here. He's getting armor upgrades, which are more important than attack, of course, because attack upgrades just makes outlaws kill themselves faster. So he ha he got uh, both gunslingers and fixers safe house. And now he just has a uh, take us. I thought that he would be going serious first, but... Actually, now the uh, second outlaw is uh, available, now the third one, because he has the mastery. And now he has both Nikara and Sirius together, which is interesting. Okay, so we have a... Uh, uh, I again upgrades, but uh, upgrades kind of great. Production, okay, CCVs. We have, but I can always uh, see here uh, what, uh, what gear does he have. See, these four marks indicate the four gears over here. <coughs> okay, so for now no gear, just the armor now, plus two armor starting, second engineering bay. Okay, now with Nikara it's a lot easier. Have turrets, of course. He has to be careful with the grenades. Okay, now has a uh, detection for Nikara, which is of course important to see the mines. Okay, Sirius, turret, okay. There is that turret. Let's see what gear we first uh, will get. You need careful, okay, so you throw a grenade and then you have to be very fast to, to lift before grenade actually deals damage. So that's the, if you are fast enough, like the two is, that's uh, what you can do. Okay, now getting nuke. Yeah, nuke will help a lot. Okay, a little bit of grenade, but Nikara will uh, heal. Okay, so first gear for Nikara, that's uh, the, actually second one. Uh, Healing rate of super heal by 100%, which is of course uh, understandable. I don't even know, maybe I learned how how they are even called pros, pros, uh, Procyon Serum. I'll probably forget. <laughs> I know what they do, but uh, the names are like... Uh... Okay, I think Eumogen Repair Nanites should be second gear that he uh, purchased, that's the one that uh, enhances reinvigorating burst. Okay, we have now that... Wait, what? Ah, now we're getting detection, that was only because, because the turret provided that. Yeah, the, we have serious turrets, you don't need uh, rush detection, but then when detection is, is done, only the range of detection won't be... 
optimal because of, of course, uh, the other mastery. Uh, outlaw ability, uh, availability, not uh, not uh, the three outlaw research improvement, which is kind of okay because three outlaw also enhances the speed, so it would be maybe too much after those. Okay, Vega, that's interesting. Like I would, I would expect maybe another healer or something. Enemies, by the way, Dark Templar composition, which kind of, in most cases, the easiest Protoss comp to to fight. You just need, of course, to have detection, but he now has two detectors plus the turrets. Okay, and uh, yeah, stealing units is actually pretty good. Steal special units with are, uh, well, have a lot of HP, hard to kill. So now this immortal is another. Ooh, 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 that's uh, okay, but that was maybe intentional. Now he will nuke this. Usually I nuke here behind, but now, I mean, you need to be fast, you need to clear these things. He will, I don't believe he will go for bonus. Okay, now we have the, yeah, the life and armor level 3 and in sh uh, endurance supplements, which in ca indicates that the rattlesnake will be uh, the last one. Oh, it's good to have extra healer. It is okay, so he's prioritizing uh, the Nikara. Now, uh, twin heal beam, so can heal uh, two targets at once. Okay, uh, okay. Oh, probably. Uh, shut down the TV, so. Uh, <laughs> um, some documentary about World War II. Okay, um. Okay, now has to defend. Okay. Just in time. Okay, so now it's actually easier. Now he has anti... Oh, terror rounds actually. Hmm, interesting. And they probably go explosion for turrets. Okay, if they run around, that's also kind of okay. It's Protoss against Zerg, I would definitely go the 99. I almost always go the 99 first. In some cases, I go anti air. That almost never terror rounds. Terror rounds may be good in really hard mutation and you have a uh, Avenger and something like that. Okay, so he now has all the outlaws, two healers, Sirius with turrets, has Vega to steal units, so that's pretty good. Uh, it would be good to steal. Ooh, uh, stealing. Oh, and even saves, but uh, at the expense of Vega, <laughs> he saved the uh, uh, carriers from uh, the mines, but now... Uh, okay, but you can see that uh, Odin is actually immune. That's uh, It wasn't the case before, uh, as well as the pack leaders, but uh, Odin is map boss, uh, like pa like the Hakka's pack leader, so it's uh, immune to the double-edged. Now, and th that was the last two years since the, the last patch where Tangorcraft actually fixed the the uh, Dacron bug and it, the, he did it so that it now actually the pack leaders are totally immune to double-edged and so is Odin. Okay, that's why he, he went for Odin the mastery, but then again he didn't want to go. I mean, actually, yeah, I'm stupid, uh, the challenge was... Maybe he would go the Dutiful Dog Walker, but the challenge was to play P0. So I think the weapon for Tycho's P0 is actually the best here. Yeah, and Odin being immune to damage nukes actually mean a lot, especially when you have a... Uh, when you have uh, Mastery, so you have more Odins. And... Uh, 
I have to be careful with grenade. Okay, now grenade would actually be good because the Tychos has protection. It's 400, uh, 400 protective. Is it for yeah, for 400 damage over 20 seconds? So sur would survive and also it's at plus four armor, meaning he already has 840 HP. Okay. And he has to deal with this. Odin is not yet uh, 90 seconds till Odin, so okay, grabbing all the strong things. Yeah. So now Nikara and Sirius have uh, he's going plus five armor. Nikara is also plus one attack. Uh, Nikara and Sirius uh, are on full gear, which is great. Rattle Snake has first two and I think it he will stop at this because these two are just a nuisance actually for Rattle Snake to kill itself faster. Um, like uh, attack speed and uh, healing rate that's the uh, most important. Now with two healers it's a really good counter to double edged. Okay. Here we go. This colossus outranges the thing. It has a uh, external. Ex By now, I think colossus should have extended thermal lens, or they get it at 20 minutes. I think at 16 minutes, 16 minute uh, mark, they get extended thermal lens. Okay, there are still mines over here. But okay, now when Odin is uh, here. Oh, and already he used nuke here, which is a good spot because there's a lot of stuff here. So everything's clean, including the mines if they were there. Okay, so now the thing is that now everything here is cleared because otherwise it would hit or run as uh, transport. And this SCV is very smart thing because now he can get here and uh, has vision and deal with these guys before they reach, like because otherwise. They, have to wait them to reach over here and then he would already have to fight these attack waves and now uh, he dealt with it pretty good okay this uh, cannon i forgot to observe uh, i forgot to tell you the first time i watched the replay it was uh, like this cannon uh, kind of get a few shots on orana which kind of i think this was proper on purpose uh, left uh, this cannon here and probably even this one here, so they can shoot at Orana a little bit. So see that she didn't receive a lot of damage, but it slowed her down, so he can, has more time to clear over here. So that that's the, that's the thing. Now Inji base uh, are going to be built. She's also pretty cute to tank something because he has pretty much upgrades. And you see the Taiko upgrades were skipped entirely. Okay. I think he will get some later, but uh, now Vegas upgrades are also uh, fully done. Vegas gear, which is uh, good because now he can, uh, with ultimate gear, he can have stolen units last for a lot longer. Okay, let's see. Uh, this talker will now last for 720 seconds. That's. Uh, <laughs> That's a lot. That's uh, twelve. That's twelve uh, minutes. It'll probably be till the end of the game, or so, or almost. I kill that of Oh yes, there we go. <laughs> okay, now second tower will be here because the first one was. Uh, now, if he chose this, it definitely did choose uh, the last one not to have to. Work with oh, the tank has died. A grenade, probably, huh? or the mines, even. And that's a lot of injury base now. Okay, nice nice to deal with this tower. I don't know if he will even revive the. Okay, he is reviving Tychus. Although Odin is uh, actually pretty soon to be done, so he didn't even have to. Okay, he has to go here. Tower can wait a bit. 
Yeah, uh, it was actually, I think it was the only mistake he did that he, he revived the Tychus because he didn't have to. Now Tychus might even, oh, almost <laughs> died. So, uh, he could have actually uh, just waited for Odin. But then again, he now doesn't have any, anywhere to, to use Odin because definitely don't want to use it like on bonus if you don't plan to do it or something like that. now that's uh okay i think it will still remain above 3000 still this thing over here <laughs> yeah he doesn't waste time on unnecessary target ooh, 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 now now these buildings are kind of working against him okay yeah but he's now getting odin there okay odin will odin can tank oh this uh, okay nuke over here nice Okay, okay, so we now do have a uh, first two gears for Tychus mm, Okay, grenade damage. I don't know if I would take it. I think I would take definitely implosion core but uh, Grenade damage is kind of risky. Ooh Okay, stopped in time Stopped in time. I see that he did. Yeah, he I think he did choose uh, this uh, area too So the only doesn't have to go up the up the hill and then also here would be a lot of enemies guarding this one I think that there are fewer enemies guarding this one than uh, than this one okay so now go oh, stealing some archons unfortunately archons cannot be healed because they are mostly shield but okay I mean stealing them getting rid of a few uh, high HP units will probably kill themselves pretty fast yeah <laughs> first one it's already down okay now SCV is coming and they will build more stuff okay clearing this first because this, there will be first suppression tower here Now going over here. Colossal are not so worth stealing because they are they don't do a lot of damage. Ooh, 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 ooh. What was hit? Carrier. Hmm. Don't know. Can't kill this high. Oh, well, that's uh, stuff. They're actually hitting Orana. Ooh, Tychus! Okay. Burst, nice. Okay. Vega. Oh, Vega actually has two charges. Would be good to steal these immortals. Yeah, nuke this. Kill the hybrid and more, uh, more of these things being built. Yeah, there's uh, look at this, still uh, a lot of minerals, even some gas. And as he is now on five one, I think it will stay this way. Nothing in production. Okay, it's few few auto turrets over here. That's that's good. To spend minerals. Okay, and now uh, clever thing to do is to get Odin here to work on this. Because Odin has a lot of deals a lot of damage against ground stuff. But the tourists also kill themselves pretty fast, but I mean it's uh, basically now free uh, damage dealing and tanking because if you're floating that much, that many minerals. Okay, more uh, turrets. Also useful against this. Okay, 
Okay, now attack wave is coming. Getting here. Grabbing Phoenix. Interesting, a lot of Phoenix is grabbed. Okay, now this comes in handy provision. Ooh, now these guys are. <laughs> he has to heal his own uh, in G Bay. Okay. I still like adept, okay. Okay, and that's uh, okay. That's not it yet. We have uh, okay. I would like one of these turret a little bit further here for more explosion damage. Okay, attack wave is already done, I believe. So uh, now it just has to kill this, and then will be the last wave. Yeah, that turret should be should have been like a little bit further there. Okay, now uh, these guys will be nuked. Okay, these turrets actually kill quite a few stuff. The tower has ceased its fire. At least something is going right. And the last wave. And there we go. That's it. Uh, GG. See, he skipped uh, this gear because it uh, would then uh, deal too much damage, harder to to, to uh, harder to heal them. Okay, let's see the damage-wise stats. So yeah, take a shredder grenade cooldown, outlaw availability, and Odin cooldown. That was that were the masteries. Uh, so in normal circumstances, you can. Uh, I mean, I almost always go for. Uh, Outlaw research improvement and uh, medivac, but uh, actually, uh, if you are very confident in your play, you don't, don't have to. On the maps, okay, on this map, you want to kind of have medivacs, but uh, um, special on uh, missed opportunities. But then, Odin, more Odin is always good. 120, that's a full two minutes of uh, Odin cooldown reduction. Uh, okay, so rattlesnakes. Okay, yeah, Odin did a lot. Odin actually did the most things more than okay, Sirius plus Warhound, Warhound turrets, still less than than Odin 15.3 turrets and Sirius in cell 6. Vega 5.8 percent. That's actually pretty, pretty good for Vega 5.8 percent. Stalkers 2.9. That was <laughs> that's kind of. It's expecting maybe mortal soul void rays to do more. No, let's say void ray 2.8, Phoenix 2.4, Rattlesnake 12.6, Interceptor 3.4. Okay, Interceptor actually did um, yeah, most of these uh, stolen units. And these auto turrets were those build ones. So that's the thing. Okay, pretty nice game. Let me just see the. Let me just see the overlay. Here we go. So, uh, say that he didn't have a crazy Tychus APM. I mean, Tychus, you can have like 150 or so. But uh, it's important to know what you are doing, to know the master is to know outlaw uh, combinations. And yeah, also if you kind of get uh, unusual combination, it slows you down because then you have to think. Uh, your master memory memory works. For example, for me, like you're always going t serious first, uh, and then uh, usually Nux. So that's kind of this hotkeys for for them. And now when you have the that I believe he too. So when you have uh, the other outlaws like the Snickara second, and then Sirius, and then uh, Vega, then it kind of messes up your hotkeys. So you have to you know. Uh, use your brain more to actually think. Yeah, this is for for this outlaw. So uh, 
This is the thing you can kill wise as the Odin also the most uh, serious 24% Tychus 18, Rattlesnake 10, Vegas, Vegas 6% Okay, so 163 mines killed and Vega actually grabbed 59 units, which is pretty good. <coughs> That's uh, 59 units uh, uh, less that deals damage to you, and less that you deal uh, damage to yourself by attacking them, and also they deal damage to... Uh, they fight for you there, so it's kind of, in this case, triple benefit from having Vega still stealing those 59 units. Okay, uh, that's it guys, hope you liked it, like and subscribe if uh, you uh, did, and also you can support me on Patreon if you like uh, my content, if you want to support me or need any help. Uh, thanks again, see you guys.